What is Kimbanda? Kimbanda is a set of practices centered around Eshu and Pombojiro. Hello, my name is Conrad. I'm an astrologer and I'm a Kimbandero from Brazil. Eshu and Pombojiro are basically Brazilian ancestors, spirits connected to this history of Brazil. Eshu of the Kimbanda is not the same as Eshu Orisha, and I shall explain that on the next video. Kimbanda is traditional Brazilian witchcraft. It is considered to be very powerful and it is said to be a left-hand path. The way it differs from Umbanda and Candomblé and other traditions that also work with Eshu and Pombajira is that the Kimbanda is the exclusive worship of Eshu and Pombajira. So whereas in these practices, Eshu and Pombajira play a certain role, they have a certain job to do, in the Kimbanda they are responsible for everything and they are kings and queens, they rule. The Kimbanda is not attached to a moral code. It is a practice of resistance, of insurrection. It is connected to the oppressed people. It has been persecuted as a practice, demonized as a practice, and it has embraced. It embraces practices that other traditions have demonized and have prohibited and have considered wrong and judged immoral. It works with animal sacrifice and it does magic both to do good and bad. Kimbandero knows how to bless and knows how to curse. They know how to open the pathways and how to close them, how to bring healing and how to bring illness. Eshu and Pombajira are complete in themselves. They are spirits that were oppressed themselves when they were alive. Sex workers, criminals, simple people, business people, merchants, witches, occultists, enslaved people, necromancers, all sorts of people. They are powerful spirits and the Kimbanda is a powerful practice. On the next video, the difference between Eshu the Ancestor and the Orisha.